video I'm collaborating with Matisse to have brought out a new range of styling products from heat and shine sprays to hairsprays to frizz tamers this is going to be my curly look so now and again if I'm going to events or if I just really want to kind of umph up my look for the day I will curl my hair so any curl you have is perfect so to start off with you need to protect your hair from the heat that you're going to be putting on it so this is the heat and shine spray if you want you can spray it all over your hair before you start I generally prefer when I'm curling my hair to split my hair first to split that into two sections like that and then this heat and shine spray is for heat protection up to 230 degrees which is pretty awesome so for this I would just spray it into the hair all the sections that I'm about to put the heat onto it smells really nice Excuse the uh, lead right in front of my face. <laughs> there aren't as many plugs in this room to help me with this. These curls are probably going to hold so well as well because I've got the heat and shine spray going through them. I've got the texturizing spray. And it'll all help to really hold those curls in. Big time actually. Okay, halfway done, this takes so long. Okay, so I'm just going to take this off and I'm going to spray it up with the heat and shine spray first. This looks totally covered. First piece from behind with the wand, wrapping it round flat and holding it for 10 seconds. Wire. <laughs> and we're done okay so my usual way after doing these curls I'm gonna brush them out because otherwise they look crazy so this is how that looks I'm gonna put a bit more of the XXL volume spray through this of course if I haven't already done it before then this is exactly what I'll be doing so just a bit of volume spray into the roots Loads and loads and loads of oomph. By the way, I'm really sorry if I'm looking here all the time because I'm using that as my mirror because I don't have any other mirror here. You are my mirror right now. I'm also going to put a bit of the smooth and frizz tamer through the ends just to keep them smooth and curly, but I don't want that frizz. So I'm just going to put a little bit of this through. It'll keep all the curls nice and smooth and defined. And of course, some of the Hold Me Hairspray to finish. 